What's up you guys? My name is Ivan Neon and this is Castlevania. Now, I really don't know anything much about the Castlevania series uh, other than that you play at, other than that you play as this um character whose name is um Simon Belmont or Trevor Belmont or a, a, any any other characters whose last name is Belmont, most likely the Belmont family. And you enter the castle, uh, uh, which is Dracula's castle, is where you actually um, fight all the enemies. And then you, and then as soon as you get to the top of the castle, you fight Dracula. That's pretty much all, all I know about the series. But other than that, I really don't know any, anything much about much about um, the, the game. So it's actually my first time playing it. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm playing this on the NES version. And um, I'm actually um, using this on Wii Remote Controller. You, you know what I actually found um, very interesting? That whenever you actually um, hold the, the Wii Remote um, Controller um, like this, doesn't it kind of make you feel like that you're playing with the actual NES control? I literally just I literally just um, f f figured it out. You know, I mean, I didn't realize it at first, but like w w when you think about it. It almost kind of like the same thing as the NES control. Well, ju just a little bit. But anyway, enough of all that. Let's just get right into the game. Alright. Castlevania, let's do this. Am I the only one that always gets chills whenever I hear that um, intro music? Oh well, I gotta say, I really do like the, uh, I really do like um, this kind, of, this music, the first stage. If I can remember, um, it's actually called the Vampire Killer or something. I don't know. So basically, in this game, you play as um, a character named Simon Belmont. Your only weapon is the whip. Then you go into this. Then you go inside the castle, and then you just fight all the hordes of enemies. And as you make your way up towards to Dracula to fight him. Well, seriously, I, I really do like. I really do like like this music. It's really nice. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me again. This cough just really doesn't want to give me a break. Speaking of cat, speaking of um, not catching a break, I also heard that it's one of the most um hardest game throughout the entire series. Well, it doesn't seem that to hard. It doesn't seem hard right now, but as you move on, then that, that's when the stage gets really complicated. Well, all right, got that back. Back off. All right. Whoa. We respond. All right. What are those things? Fish goblins or something? Oh damn it! I missed the clock. I gotta be. Oh sweet! I got the clock back. Thank you, game. I really gotta say, um, out of all the sub weapons. Um, throughout the entire series of Castlevania, the clock is most likely the best, and I just got hit. Which is stupid. The only kind, the only kind of downside is that it costs like, um, 5% up, it costs like 5 hearts. Normally in, in regular games, especially like in Zelda, whenever you see hearts, you would think that it would replenish your health. But no, not in this game. In this game, Basically, it kind of, it kind of represents some ammunition through your sub weapons. Almost, almost the same thing as um, Kid Icarus. When Kid Icarus, um, the hearts represents money. All right, this is the first boss. Oh wow, that was so hard. <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. It wasn't really that hard. All right. Got the first storm, 
and uh, we just move on. Oh, look how many hearts I got. So I got a lot of hearts. Alright, that's cool. So every time that when you complete the stage, it shows you a map. Time to move on. Hey, beat it. I'm not gonna waste my time fighting against this knight. Ha! Alright, there's the door. Whoa, those Medusa heads! I gotta say, out of all the enemies that are a complete pain in the ass, I gotta say that the Medusa heads are one of the most frustrating enemies throughout the entire series. And I and I don't ha and I haven't even played any of the Castlevania series until now. I mean, I, I did I did see um, the Castlevania series in Netflix. That was, that was actually pr pretty interesting too. I mean, even though they only had like um, four episodes, it's still it's still very interesting to watch. Oh, oh, come on, really? How was I not paying attention? This is what this is what I what I was talking about. Those Medusa heads are so freaking annoying, man. Always up on your ass. All right, I'm just gonna pretend that didn't happen. But yeah, as I was, wait, hold on. Let me let me be quiet so I can focus on this part. Stop! It. Come on, man. All right, that 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 was a blow. Yo! When I heard um, people say that um, Castlevania is one of the most... Whoa, what is that? Oh, that's cool! I don't know what just happened, but... That was actually pretty cool. Alright, this time I won't die. Go, go, go! Don't you dare. Let's just keep moving. I hate those, I hate those damn Medusa heads, man. This game was actually made, made, made in the 80s. I, I mind you, so I really don't know anything much about it, but I wasn't actually born in the 80s, I was born in the 90s. Back then, when I used to play on um, video games, it was the first console that I ever had. If I can remember, was the was the PlayStation One. If I can remember, um, the games that I actually used to play first was um, Spyro, and then it turned to um, Crash Bandicoot. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys already know who Spyro and Crash Bandicoot is. But yeah, back in the day, I, I, I used to play um, a lot of um, PlayStation 1 games. I didn't actually um, play um, the, the, any of the Nintendo series, well, until the Nintendo 64 came out. And then, if I can remember, the game that I actually used to play was um, Zelda, Super Smash Brothers, which is one, one of my favorite. 
Oh, oh, what the hell? I thought I still had the time clock. Well, I'm on my last life. Damn it! How was I not that fast? All right, I'm 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 trying this again. Yo, I I never played a, a, any kind of games like this. As a matter of fact, um, well, I, well, I already told you. Um, back then I used to play uh, a lot of um, three-dimensional games like the um, the PlayStation. Nintendo 64, and that, and that's pretty much it. I never played a any any games that are like if a bit. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. Time to move on. Hopefully, this time I won't screw up. I don't know why I throw another one. Thought there was gonna be another another one. Alright. Time to go do this part again. Screw you! Stop it! Yo, I really don't know what the hell I'm doing, man. I never play games like this. I do have a, a, another Castlevania game, and it's called um, Castlevania Adventure Re Rebirth, but that's only on the WiiWare. I'm not quite sure. I'm, I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna be able to um, do do a full do a, a, a let's play of that. I mean, if you got, if you, I mean, if you are interested, um, then let me know on the comments. Other, other than that, um, I might as well just um, give it a shot, anyways. Although I still need to finish um, my playthrough of um, Sonic Lost World. All right. Go, go, go. Alright, I made it. See, this is the reason why the clock is always my favorite. Can I get another heart? Thank you. Haha, <laughs> what now, sucker? You don't match for me as long as I got the clock. Yeah, I highly, I highly recommend um, keep keeping the clock and try to get a lot of hearts, as many as possible. Shit. Screw the Medusa heads. All right, this is the second boss. Nope. You're gonna die. See, I'm telling you. As long as you got that clock and as long as you got a lot of hearts, you're completely unstoppable. All right, time to move on to the third stage. Kinda, I think I'm kind of doing well. Well, kind of. Well, I do have my first game over, but I'm just gonna pretend that didn't happen. Crap. Okay, so those enemies are what? Supposed to be hunchbacks? 
Those are those are uh, another one of the most annoying enemies. Skeleton, well, skeleton can't be that annoying. I mean, yeah, he throws his bones and then he jumps to random places, but still, I don't think he's that much of an annoyance. Oh, nice. Alright, so this game is being nice. I like that. Yeah, here's some holy water for ya. Right. Oh well, uh, I don't need the axe. And get a lot of hearts as possible. How did that not hit? Yeah, I'm just gonna keep on moving. Screw you guys. Got the clock back. And invincibility. That has to be like what? 50 se like 15 seconds or 10? Trying to use this as sparingly as possible. For real? Nope. Come on. Not today. Yeah, screw you, Medusa heads. They're not worth my time. Shit! Right? As soon as I go right to the boss. Yo, you need. Yo, you really need the clock, man. I should have never gotten that knife. Okay, that was messed up. Oh, that was nice. But can I please get the clock back? Please, the clock is awesome! Oh, damn it. I know, I know you could also um, reflect um, enemies projectile with using a whip, but sometimes using a whip is kind of like delayed. Really got to time it right. What are those supposed to be? Like mummies or something? Alright, I guess I just do it like this then. Aw, oh, damn it, I didn't think that was gonna hit me. Alright. Went, went through that again. Okay, somehow I got a one up. Jump. All right, keep moving. Come on, I I hit that. Damn it. 
seriously, how are you supposed to beat those mummies? I keep, why do I keep on ju jumping th through that, man? This is really getting so annoying. Aren't, aren't video games are supposed to be fun and not to piss you off or something? I already, I already have been through a lot in, in Smash Brothers Wii U. When trying to beat um, both Classic and Adventure Mode on a hard difficulty. <coughs> Alright, don't fall for that that time. Oh my god. I literally got nothing to say. I never play any video games like this. No, I, I, I'm, I'm serious. I never play any kind of video game like this. I gotta keep on doing that just to be a damn tease, man. I hate that! Alright, that Medusa, that Medusa um, disappeared. I don't know why, but whatever. Jump! <sighs> Unbelievable, man. Seriously, I've never played any vi video games like this, man. Alright. I'll give it one last shot. Stupid ghost. Stupid hunchbacks. Whoa, what the hell? I don't know how the hell happened. I don't know how, what I did just to um, trigger him to calm down, but whatever. <sighs> Alright. I don't know what I just did there. I didn't, I didn't just... <sighs> Whatever. There we go. What? Stupid hunchback. I'm really I'm starting to I'm sorry, but I'm really I'm starting to lose my patience w with this game. I've never played any kind of video games like this, man. I mean, I ha I have played um I have played um Mega Man um before um Mega Man 2 for the NES, but nothing like this. I mean, I, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I have played um Mega Man X4, um for the PlayStation One, and even though that it really got me um a little struggles, it literally took me a lot of time just to get used to all, all, all the levels. And believe it or not, I actually beat beat the games, both X and Zero. I mean, it was tough what when, when playing at zero, but at least I managed to pull it off. Yeah, you take that holy water. Right, it's good to see that I got the hearts um, the time. But I really need more hearts. 
Cause it literally cost a lot of hearts. I mean, I, I mean, I know it only costs like um five, but you still need a, a lot of hearts. All right, I'm at this part again. And I died. <sighs> well, goodbye, clock. I know no one said and said that it, it'll be easy, but come on. Like, why you gotta make it this hard? Is it really for bragging rights or something? Oh my god, I hate those Medusa heads! Never have I played any game that literally pisses you off. Especially if it's like a very old... Pork chop! I did not know that there was a pork chop there. Oh my god, look, look at me. I'm just standing there taking taking it like like a taking it like a freaking idiot. Crap and I fall through that one again. Oh my god, man. You know what? I I'm I'm done. I'm sorry, but I'm I'm done. I I can't take it anymore. <sighs> Ca Castlevania. I I I really have to admit, Castlevania is a is a very good series, but for some reason, I I, I really can't I I can't play I can't play this game. I, I don't know why, but I, I really can't. I I can't play this game. I mean, I'm sorry, but you know, I've I've heard that um cat the that this game is very it's very hard, but I never imagined that it could be like literally that hard. I mean, you literally got you literally got um try to dodge at everything and then try. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh, give me a chance to talk, you stupid cough. <clears throat> what was I saying? Oh yeah, it's it's really hard to keep track out of uh, uh, everything. Like um, of course, of course, you have the you have the whip, and then um, it can actually um, deflect um, its projectiles. But I, why does it look like it's extremely de delayed to me? Like you literally have to um, t t time it perfect perfectly. This game's all about trial and error. Well, either way, I'm, I'm done. Castlevania, good series, but a real hard, hard game. Oh, a really pain in the ass game. I mean, I, I hate to say it, but it, it really is, you know. But I, I do like the the series from, from Netflix, and I'm hope I'm hoping that they start um with uh, season two, you know. I'm not quite sure how many episodes are there going to be in um, season two. I know, I know that they only has like um, four episodes in the uh, in season one, but you know, if it if it's if it's more than than four, then I guess I'll be I'll be happy. But whatever. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do hope you guys uh, enjoyed this um, short um, video. Well. Not well. I'm not quite sure if, if that's short, you know, because it's like almost what 30 minutes. I don't know. A anyways, anyways, I I I'm done for the day. I I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call it a day. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you guys really do like this video, I'm pretty sure you guys know the drill by now. 
please give this video a thumbs up. It really does help me out a lot. Don't forget to subscribe if you wish to see more. I really do appreciate that. Leave a comment on the comment section below. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. This is Ivan Neon, signing off. Take care, everybody.